we obviously didn't play our best football today, but just really proud um, of us coming over here and, you know, with the conditions and everything uh, to get the game in, number one, it was a blessing. Um, and to, to play well enough to win, again, was a blessing. To get our seventh win, it's really important for us as a program. Uh, keeps us on pace for our goals the rest of the season. And uh, we're just really excited to, to be able to come here and play and win and uh, advance uh, towards next week. Uh, you know, we weren't very clean offensively. I thought our defense was very sound, didn't give up big plays, and um, gave us a chance today, and we scored enough to win in the second half. So proud the way we finished. I just really am proud on how we're playing together. Um, you know, that's what we challenged our team to do in preseason. We felt like if, if uh, you know, people are going to make yards and make plays on you at times, but if you don't give up uh, mental mistakes and give up big plays and just give people yardage and make them earn it, you can play good defense week to week, and that's all we've done. Really proud of our coaches, really proud of uh, our seniors and the leadership that we bring, and certainly gives us a chance to win every week when we play good, solid defense. One of those games where it's not pretty, you know, uh, you know, Toa's uh, pr production, uh, getting over 100 yards is really key for us to win. You know, I said it before, we really wanted to improve our, our physicality in the run game, and Toa has certainly given us that. Um, and it was really important today. You know, we played well on defense. We ran the ball tough when we needed to, and his runs are really big. And, and, uh, and Dubs, you know, two freshmen, both over 100 yards, their performances really, really pushed us over the edge on offense today. So just proud of our seniors and the leadership, uh, proud of our focus and, and continuing to fight through adversity. And uh, really, I'm really pleased that we were to get this game in today. I was afraid that it was going to get canceled and really, really, really blessed to get the game in. So uh, your third 100 yard rushing game of the season, uh, what does that say about how you're continuing to build experience uh, this season and uh, working hard to get your team wins? Uh, it's all just through the process, you know, um, just every day trying to compete, um, get better every day. And, uh, you know, with this being my third 100 yard rushing, uh, you know, it's, I just feel like there's a lot more to improve on, but um, I'm very, I feel very accomplished for where I'm at uh, right now uh, as an athlete, um, running the ball. So, uh, you know, just trying to look forward to every every week getting better. You also had quite a bit of touches today. Uh, was this something you were expecting or hoping for? You had 29 touches altogether. Uh, you know, when, when when it hits the fan, you just got to go with it. You know, whatever coach throws out there, you know, you just got to you just got to roll with the punches. You know, and. Uh, you know, with getting a lot of carries today, it was a little bit different. But um, you know, just had to get, got, got to get, got to get in my groove a little bit, and uh, you know, things turned out well. We talked last week about you getting to the second level, and that's where you make things happen. I think the best play for you actually was the touchdown run. Would you agree? Can you tell us what you saw in the touchdown run? Uh, you know, it was a little counter. So um, basically, I just followed my puller, and you know, trusted it, and uh, you know, hit it, and. You know, it opened up, it opened up perfectly and, uh, you know, it's just how we ran in practice.